Welcome back to Weekly Photo Tips on YouTube, also known as an older but still good-looking man who likes photography. Today we're going to talk about a do-it-yourself beauty dish that you can make for well under $20. Before I show you my little homemade one, I want to show you what the real deal looks like. This is a beauty dish that you would buy for between $100 and $125 to go with Alien Bees or Pro Photo Lights. No doubt this is a beautiful dish. Comes with a diffuser sock that uh, you put on it. But what I made was this. Small beauty dish. I uh, made it for my Nikon SB800s and made it, like I said, for well under $20. And there's the flash and the mount. We're going to flip it over here and what we have, this is a big old plastic salad dish that you use, you know, for summer picnics and stuff. Got it at the Christmas tree shop for 99 cents. This piece right here, this component is a door saver, which you mount on the door so when the door closes and the doorknob hits it, it doesn't poke through. Home Depot, Lowe's, $3.95. On the underside is a mirror to help reflect them and this piece right here, is the bottom component of your CD or DVD case that you buy. It's covered with silver duct tape. On the back side, you've got just the typical L bracket. I cut it down to size a little bit and had to drill a, a adjoining hole. This is a downspout from a gutter. Again, Home Depot lows a couple of dollars. And you may not be able to see it there, but inside here is the mirror. And that's pretty much how we made it. Nuts, bolts, if you notice deep inside here, all the washers that I used are rubberized washers. Uh, and the reason I did that is because every single one of these components is plastic. And my fear was if I over tightened, that I would crack the plastic. So the rubber washers gave me a little bit of uh, uh, forgiveness for screwing up. So if you stop back at weeklyphotodips.com, I'm gonna show you uh, links to the plans where you can go and actually download the plans for making your own. I'll also have some comparison photos where I'll use a flash with just a diffuser and then I'll use the beauty dish so you can see the difference in the light that you'll get. So I think that's it for this week's do-it-yourself tip on weekly photo tips on YouTube. Thanks for stopping by and we'll see you again next time. Take care.